In this movie, an American student went to Paris. There he became friends with a strange twin brother and sister. But the relationship between these two brothers and sisters is so strange. What happens next, we will explain the rest in this video. There are some movies where the outside environment affects the inner characters. And this movie is just like that. The external environment represents their inner character and mindset. In the end, I will explain this to you. Let's get straight into the explanation. Welcome back to Movie On. Today I'm going to explain the movie called The Dreamers from 2003. Spoilers ahead, watch out and take care, and I hope you enjoy it. At the beginning of this movie, we saw a guy named Matthew, and he is the main character of this movie. Matthew is the narrator of the movie. He went to Paris to complete his studies. Matthew loves movies. He has watched so many movies, and he knows everything about movies. He met twins named Isabel and Theo because of his interest in movies. There were no restrictions about screening. That's why everyone was outside watching the shoot. Matthew also came here. Isabel was standing in front of the gate. When Matthew went there, Isabel talked to him. She told him that, I always see you around, but you're always alone. Matthew told her that he came from America, and that's why he has no friends. Isabel introduced Matthew to her brother, Theo. After that, they talk about movies, and their bond got stronger. After some time, the police came there, and they ran away. They talked about different things till late at night. While walking on the roads of Paris, Matthew thought that he was so lucky that he has got two good friends. When Matthew went home, he wrote a letter to his mom. He's so happy that he has made friends here. When he woke up in the morning, he received a call from Theo. Theo invited him over to his house to have dinner with him. Matthew went to their house in the evening, and their house was so big. Isabel took Matthew to her mom to introduce him. Her mother didn't expect that Matthew was coming over for dinner, but still, she managed it. Isabel told him to meet her father and maintain a nice impression. Isabel's father was a poet, and then when they were on the dinner table, Theo's father talked about the inspiration of the poem. But Matthew was not paying attention to his words, and that's why he got mad at him and asked him, what are you thinking about? Matthew didn't say anything at first, but then he forced him. Matthew told him that, I was looking at this lighter. There is actually symmetry between this lighter and our surroundings. This lighter has beautiful harmony in it, just like the welcome music. When Theo's father heard it, he was impressed by him. Theo's father told him that, in your generation, you have some people who think like him in a constructive way. Theo's political opinion was very strong, and he always thinks that everyone is wrong. That's why his father mocked him, and they argued. Actually, Isabel's father and mother do not stay here. Since he is a poet, they keep visiting here and there. Theo and Isabel stay alone in this house. At night, their father signed a check for them and left. After their parents left, Matthew stayed. Isabel kissed him and asked, Are you staying here? And Matthew decided to stay. When Theo and Matthew were talking to each other, we saw that they always have a conflict between them. They do have conflict in their opinion, but it doesn't mean that they can't be good friends. Still, they have so many things in common. Tonight, Matthew stayed in their house. At night when he went to the toilet, he looked at Theo's room. Isabel and Theo were totally naked on the bed. Theo found it very strange and went to bed. In the morning, Isabel rubbed Matthew's eyelids and woke him up. Matthew asked her who woke someone up like this. She said, I always wake Theo up like this. Matthew found it so strange. After that, Isabel told him to get to the bathroom with her. While Matthew was brushing his teeth, Isabel came there and touched his lips and said they're so beautiful. On the other side, Theo told Matthew that you live alone. If you want, you can stay here with us. We can be friends. Matthew asked him, don't you two have any problems with this? Isabel said, actually, it was my idea. Isabel was present there, but still, Theo started talking. Theo and Isabel think they are parts of themselves. When they were born, their bodies were connected to each other, and that's why they're not ashamed of each other. Matthew thought that they had a physical relationship, but no, they do not think of themselves as individual in their mind. Matthew agreed to stay with them and shifted all of his stuff here. One day when they were hanging out, they played a game. In this game, one will tell a dialogue from a movie, and the other will have to guess the name of the movie. If they cannot guess the movie, then they will have to complete a dare. In an old movie, 
the characters ran from the art museum and went outside. And they did it in such a short time. That's why they got the idea of doing this. Matthew was scared that if he got caught, then he would be sent back to America. But the twins convinced him, and he did it. They were happy with their strange lifestyle. Matthew feels a bit uncomfortable with the relationship between Theo and Isabel. He doesn't understand what's going on between them. One day he asked Theo, how do you two even stay like this? Theo told him everything about how their bodies were connected when they were born, and how they think they are not individuals from each other. One day they were hanging out and played that game once again. This time Theo did a scene of a movie, but Matthew and Isabel couldn't recognize the scene, and that's why Theo dared them to have sex in front of him. Matthew got scared after hearing this, and said please don't involve me in this. Isabel took off her clothes in front of Matthew and Theo, but Matthew didn't want to do it. That's why he ran away from there, but Theo stopped him. Matthew and Isabel had sex in front of Theo, and it was the first time Isabel had sex. Theo saw this with his own eyes. After that, Matthew and Isabel continued their relationship. One day while they were on the bed, Matthew asked her, why you and Theo are like this? Isabel said, we have loved each other from our childhood. Matthew asked her, what will you do if your father finds out? She said, she would kill herself. One day, Theo and Matthew were talking to each other. Matthew told him that you two are so close to each other, but still, you two made me your own family. Theo told Matthew that I like you, but I never think that you're a part of our family. You are our friend, but still, me and Isabel were together, and always will be. Matthew found it very strange, but still, he let it go. Isabel and Theo live a very costly life. They drink so much expensive wine, and do so many expensive acts. That's why they need so much money. Their father gave them some money, but now they had no money left. They had no money to eat their food. Now they work somewhere and live their life. Theo was feeling jealous after seeing the relationship between Matthew and Isabel. One day when they were in college, Theo talked to a girl, and now they were about to go on a date. One day all of them were in the bathroom, and they were showering together. Theo and Matthew were talking about American soldiers fighting in Vietnam, and Theo thinks this is not right. He blamed all the Americans for this. Matthew said, no, this is not what you think. We are forced to do so. President orders us to go to war, and if someone doesn't go, then he will be sent to jail. That's why Matthew came here in Paris, to complete his study. The time period of this movie was from 1960. Matthew said that, I don't believe in violence. If we want to evolve, we need to do it with peace. But Theo disagreed with him. Isabel stopped them and asked Matthew, Do you love us? And do you have any proof about it? Matthew asked her, What kind of proof do you want? Isabel told him that me and Theo want to shave your pubes. Matthew got so mad at them and told them whatever you two are doing is wrong. You guys always act like kids. You guys need to grow up. He told Isabel that you don't know anything. You have never had a boyfriend, and that's why you never went on a date. You do whatever Theo tells you to do. Matthew took Isabel on a proper date. When they came back home, they saw that Theo was with a girl. Isabel heard the sound of them having sex. She felt disturbed after hearing this, and felt so jealous. Isabel cried so much. In the next scene, we saw that Theo and Matthew were drinking wine. Paris was revolting. Theo was talking about it. Matthew told him that, I don't believe what you say. You just talk about politics, but you never go to the street. Nothing will happen if you just keep talking. If you want actual changes, then you will have to go to the streets and protest. After some time, 